Zero Waste says no to incinerators, no to landfills, no to the throwaway society, yes to a sustainable society. And we need three things to get to zero waste. We need industrial responsibility at the back end, we need community responsibility at the front end, and we need good leadership to bring the two together. Uh, community responsibility begins with separation, followed by porta a porta collection systems for the compostables and the recyclables and the residuals. And there are many other things that we can do, reuse and repair and deconstruction, and of course getting the toxics out, and also waste reduction initiatives like using cloth bags instead of uh, plastic bags. Even if you made incineration safe, which I doubt because of the air emissions, the nanoparticles and the ash, the one ton of ash you get for every four tons of trash, even if you could make it safe, even if you found a place to put the ash, it still wouldn't make sense because it takes an enormous amount of money uh, to destroy resources that we should be sharing with the future. It creates very few jobs. It's not good for the economy. Obviously, there are questions about health, but the key thing is it's not sustainable at a time when we desperately need sustainable solutions. They can join up with the Beppe Grillo meetup groups, uh, 600 of these throughout Italy. Uh, there are two laws of pollution. The level of pollution increases with the level of corruption. That's the bad law. The good law is the level of pollution decreases with the level of public participation. We need to clean up the political system in order to clean up the environment. As far as waste management is concerned, people can use uh, cloth bags instead of plastic bags. They can compost in their backyards. They can make sure they don't throw batteries in the trash. And, uh, um, but most importantly, put the pressure on the politicians to go with porter a porter collection systems and not waste a lot of money on dangerous incinerators. Thank you so much.